In this video, I wanted to see how many coppers it would take to beat a single champion. The rules are simple. We'll start with one copper versus one champion. If the champion wins, then we'll add another copper to the team until it begins to be too much for the champion. If this video gets 5,000 likes, then I'll do a part two where we spice it up a little bit. Be sure to subscribe as over 80% of you guys watching this video right now are not subscribed. If you already subscribed though, be sure to turn post notifications on as I upload daily and you won't want to miss any of these bangers. Anyways, thank you so much for watching and enjoy the rest of the video. Alright, here we go. So first 1v1, uh, as I said earlier, I'm going to be doing the 1v1 and then the 1v2, the 1v3, so on and so forth. As long as I can stay alive. Now if I die off rip and I immediately lose to the... Uh, to the the copper player that's gonna be so embarrassing but i did a background check on all of these guys chat people always say how oh, these aren't real coppers i promise you these are real coppers bro i had them send me clips of them playing there are six tabs everything these are real coppers right here it was hard to find let me tell you bro finding coppers is, is hard man it ain't no joke uh and if you want to play in any of my videos then be sure to check out the link in the description to check out my discord server and join that for completely free all right so let's take a look at the bands here so we've got a a thatch which is me i'm gonna go ahead and also ban capkin because this doesn't matter i'm on defense but the ones that matter to me are the finca and the thorn i will be playing no finca and no thorn uh or more 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 likely i'm not playing thorn because i'm only on defense all right so i'm gonna go upstairs first and i'm gonna run thunderbird but with impact grenades instead of a c4 that way i can make rotates and i can kind of maneuver and play around the site a little bit easier now something that you'll know and that you'll notice like watching lower ranking players that they take forever to push we need to protect um, maybe this guy's not like that but i'm gonna go on in a wing here and say that i probably have more than 45 seconds of prep base just because they push so slow bro I'm gonna place my heels last, and then I'm just gonna reinforce everything. All right, so we've got a good amount of walls up, and I've, I've gotten six walls up now. I like to barricade this as a noise cue, and then also this here. Do some heels. Alright, so he's doing a big window too. That's bad because I didn't set up with that. Come on, peek it. Air jabs, okay. I'm done. Woo! My life flashed before my eyes there. Oh, I missed. Nah, bro. He can have that. He can have the big window. All right, GG. Bro, this guy is a big window menace. Listen, you see this guy on Nomad going big window? Don't even peek him. That guy's scary. All right, so that is round one. Done. It's like the hardest gun. This is like the hardest uh, battle of my entire life. Over. Five seconds left. be a little bit more aggro on this freezer guy like I need to be I try something dumb
Let's go. There we go. I kind of want to get a spawn peak, bro. I'm going to be honest. I don't think there's much site setup in this site, which is a good thing. It means I don't have to do much of anything. I'm going to put down my banshees. I'm going to try to shoot their drones. Hopefully, they don't see me spawn peeking. And if I can take one or two of them off, bro, off spawn, like that's going to be free. That right there is pretty much the setup done. Like, what else are you going to do? Not too concerned with reinforcing. These guys all watch my videos, though, so like. They know the spawn peaks I do and such. Be a little bit careful. Protect the biohazard container at all costs. My signature spawn peak. Hopefully they don't. My video is that much. I think they spawn construction. Was that I'm gonna try something really risky, guys. go 1v3 baby let's go gg you gotta pick your gunfights man you gotta isolate the ones no matter if it's a copper player it's a champion player it's all about isolating the ones man all you gotta do located the biohazard container all right how am i going to kill them this let's Where'd he go? Oh, I took a lot of damage there. Where'd you? Nice try, though. Thirty seconds. Three, two, one, two. 
the Friendly's victorious. BG. So when it comes down to actual gunfights, that was like pretty easy for me to win. But, you know, it is what it is. All right, here we go. This is going to be difficult. This is difficult no matter what the ranks are. 1v5 in Siege is difficult. I'm going to go meeting hall. Ah, should I go meeting hall? I'm not going to go up top again because I already won up top. I I I'll go I'll go meeting. That's fine. You sound to win. win. Uh oh, I need to hurry up. Oh, no. I'm trying to feel Maverick. Oh man, Amaru. Good luck on that one. Yeah, no, just push him right away. <laughs> You're gonna fly in there and get one tapped. By so it's supposed to be impossible impossible at three. We're going to five. So I'm gonna have to do something crazy to win this. Malusi, I'm not Malusi, they banned Malusi. Can't be Malusi. I would like to get a spawn peek, but. Mm, I just don't know where to get a spawn peek at. These guys have been pretty elusive. You would think coppers are the easiest to spawn peek, but these guys have been hard to spawn peek, man. Five seconds left. We've tried almost every round. Watch him have a drone here, and I'm just dead. behind me for sure. Uh oh. Hold up, I'll take that. I'll take the damage. Reach it. Recharge ready. Is it still in there? Oh, I man. doubt it. Yeah, I doubt it as well. Yeah, back to back. He's wrapping around. Sh uh, shower side. I'm gonna cut him off. Kitchen. Yep, kitchen. Kitchen right now. Alright, he's not sweet. Kitchen downstairs. Alright, I'm coming. Alright, I, I need. I still need to. I'm. I, I still need a drone first. Further access to the bio. Hostiles from securing the biohazard container. Protect the biohazard. No, dude, there's too many angles, man. Too many angles. GG's. They got me in the they got me in the 1v5. I was doing good, but I just looked the wrong way. Man. Alright, well GG's. I guess five. Five coppers does it. Five coppers. It, it begins to be possible where I just I just there's too many angles for me to look at, man. There's just too much going on and I just don't know even like what to do. Um I think that would have been possible if I just repositioned myself a little bit better. I kind of got a couple kills and then stayed in the same spot. But uh, that was fun. That was a lot of fun. Can't lie.